The school needs a history, a visible a pictorial and text of the history of the school. Gloria, this has been a labor of love for her for over eight years to collect the information, to assemble the wall, to design it, uh, to find the space, to, to get the um, artisan to do it. Uh, so this has clearly been something that she has been more than passionate about. She's been supported by it in her family since the death of her husband, Dr. Ralph Leishner, who was the senior associate de dean. Uh, his vision is this building. With the new education building, al alumni in particular didn't have uh, a connection to the new school and that a history wall would connect them again. They would see their era up there on the wall and make them feel at home and I think that was very important to my husband. He really wanted the alumni to feel like this was their school as well even though they didn't go to school here. And I think the history wall uh, expresses in a very dramatic fashion the history of who we are. We have been very much a part of Chicago for medicine for now a hundred years. And it really says to, to everyone that we are very special. And we're special in a very unique way. We're the only surviving Catholic Jesuit medical center which is fully integrated with its university and its healthcare system. We're the only one left in the country. To me, to read what they went through to keep this school alive is worth reading and sharing with new students, with the parents, with alumni who may not even know what went on back then. I, I just feel like it's, it's a wonderful story to be told.